The North Dakota Game and Fish Department has been monitoring chronic wasting disease in North Dakota for years. Chronic wasting disease is a disease of the cervids in North Dakota. It infects the, the nervous system, and so once an animal is infected, um, it'll look perfectly normal for a number of months, 18 to 20 months, um, but unfortunately it's invariably fatal. CWD was first found in North Dakota in 2009 in Deer Hunting Unit 3F2, and in 2018 in a few deer hunting units in the Northwest. Thankfully, the disease prevalence is relatively low in North Dakota. One way that CWD can be artificially spread is by improper disposal of high-risk carcass parts. Uh, we know that CWD is especially concentrated in the, the brain and spinal column, and so hunters who unknowingly uh, discard those carcass parts on the landscape uh, have the potential to introduce that disease into a new area. Hunters have a new transportation option this year that involves taking photos after harvesting and tagging your deer. They'll take two pictures with your phone with the date and timestamp on, one of the entire animal at the harvest site, and then one close-up of the tag either on the antler if it's a buck or on the ear if it's a doe. Dr. Bonson says you'll then bone or quarter out the animal as you typically would and then take the head to a collection site or leave it at the harvest site. So we know that this disease is uh, um, if left unchecked, if spread across the landscape in years to come could have some, some major impacts and so this is a, a great thing that hunters can do to lower the risk of spreading this uh, disease. Hunters should be mindful where they dump the remains. Uh, landfill after you're done processing or the taxidermist is done processing, um, a CWD collection site if you're doing surveillance, or finally uh, it could just be left at the harvest site. If you're hunting private property and plan on leaving the carcass at the harvest site, make sure you have landowner permission. This is Mike Anderson in the North Dakota Outdoors.